So, androgynous, when I was looking at the clothes, you guys are doing this thing. Yes. Um, I thought they were maybe Mrs. Brown, but I wasn't sure, and I was too much of a chicken to ask you. Yeah, ask us any and, question you want. But look at, Mark and I got dressed together this morning, and I thought we could interchange. I'm wearing Chuck's pants, he could wear my pants, and we're yes. wearing the same size. So you're doing the androgynous thing? Well, I think you are. I mean, is that where clothing is going? Uh, I, stuff, I would wear anything in your collection. I think that there is one but you're a very specific woman, okay. and so that's why I think it works for you. I think a lot of women might wear some of the different pieces. Claire um, does. Claire does, and she wears our trousers. I think that's an incredible compliment because, um, you know, for us, we really believe that sexuality is on a continuum, and that, uh, you know, all the labels and the boxes of straight, gay, whatever, uh, it drives me crazy. And so for you to say that, Collection feels to you like you can be worn by men and for women is really a lovely thing. This okay. is Thank you. very mentorship. I don't really like that word. I think it's a bit old fashioned. I don't know, but androgynous. Well, how about just for people? For everybody. Uh, when we started with Ducky Brown 10 years ago, I wanted to do a collection for people. And I think that there are certain restrictions sometimes that you have to. I mean, you know, there are certain words that I won't use anymore, like gay or straight or lesbian or whatever. Um, I think that it's funny how we, you know, people, is it for men or women? Is this a man's or a woman's? Am I in the men's or women's section? You know, it's like, well, uh, aren't we people? Well, and also, people I think who need people. You should I wear what you feel good in. I don't think that there are men or women. I mean, I think there's a lot in between. But I there think are that's, well, There are men and I mean, women. people are. Yeah. Identify themselves well, most But there's a lot of in between. It's yin yang. Yes. You know, we're both masculine and feminine. I think like there was a, if it feels right, it looks good. There was a there's a picture of a boy over there. I think it's number. You know where the model cards are? Yeah. yeah. I think it looks like a woman. And there was one on the with floor. With a long black hair? Yeah. It looks like a woman. It looks like a woman's outfit. It looks like a woman's long skirt. It looks like a woman. I mean, it looks like a woman's, but it's on a man. And it's, but we're not doing that tranny kind of, you know. No. I always get a little bit scared of that, you know, androgynous that you're doing trannies or something, and it's all like makeup and hair. I don't think of androgynous as tranny or or F -tab or F -tab. I just think that we're kind of we're sensitive beings, and we make beautiful clothing, and we're happy if men want to buy them. Uh, and we're happy to call ourselves a men's line, but we do actually and want to continue to buy our family. That's great too. But there are no rules. Yeah, I mean, Claire over there wears a lot of our clothes. She wears a lot of our sweater on. And that was not from a women's line. No. I mean, great, man. No. Perfect. All right, thank you. Thank you. Um, thank you.